Um, we're expecting tourists to come back slowly. Um, initially, we're expecting um, a lot of people that want to come back to Dubai, that maybe live or have to business in Dubai, or uh, repatriate back to their own countries. But we're expecting tourism to come back slowly um, from the 7th of July. I think a lot of people are still putting off um, traveling internationally, especially to, to further destinations such as Dubai. So, you know, European travelers will probably, you know, for the majority, I would expect them to, uh, you know, travel within Europe or, or, to, or to other destinations. Um, and, you know, the, the main market, uh, I would expect uh, to be uh, a regional traveling and staycation. Dubai has been recognised as handling this, and, and the UAE has been recognised as handling this uh, very well, um, and it's been ranked in the top three across the world uh, for, the, for the way the situation's been handled. And I think that will give people confidence when they're ready to travel to come to Dubai. And I think, yeah, it will take time to come back. You know, we're not expecting on the 7th of July for all the routes to be open and for, for tourism to be back to the same numbers as before. Um, however, we are expecting to be one of the first markets to be back because of, because of the confidence that we can give to people that are travelling. <laughs> Dubai is ready, Dubai is open. Uh, the major attractions are all open uh, across the city. The malls, uh, the beaches and uh, all public spaces are, are open. <laughs>